Alrighty, welcome back everybody. So, as you can see, this is episode whatever it is of Aliens Isolation. So, <clears throat> uh, we just got our shit rocked. Um, coming over here from our ship uh, to investigate this ship because it has the black box of uh, the Nostromo, which was uh, my mother's ship, or the character's mother's ship. Ooh. So, uh, I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go just yet, but let's go ahead and save real quick. Uh, so I think right now we're just looking to uh, find the black box, I think is what I need to do. Or find help or something. Uh, I can't. Don't have a map. Let's see. Can I sprint? <gasps> Yay, I can sprint. Uh, nothing over here. So, yeah. Let's go and see what this. Oh! Hey! Oh. I'm, uh. <laughs> like. Oh! Oh! Oh, yeah! <clears throat> yeah, you're telling me, lady. <laughs> oh. Well, that's not good. Where the hell's a marshal checkport? Marshmallow thingy. Anything? Ah, there's nothing. Okay. Ooh, what's all this? Whoa! Shit. Huh. Well, uh... Probably shouldn't go that way. So I think I'm gonna go through this. Climb. I <laughs> don't mind if I do. Oh, there's a wall right there. Wow, yeah. So, like I was saying in the last episode, um, the atmosphere of this game is just fantastic. It's just all the little tiny creaking of the ships and the sounds and the dust particles falling through the air and the little smoky and misty effects. It all just adds so much to this. Like, what? Oh, here's the door. Like, <clears throat> the first time I was going through this, I was so tense. Like, even though I hadn't encountered anything, um, I was pretty freaked out just by the environment alone. And uh, I don't know if you guys can tell or not, but uh, my voice is acting up again, so... Ooh, what's that? A flare? I don't need a flare. What do you gotta say? Come on. Corrupted folder. Decommissioning. Oh, that's a lot. Uh, that's not too much. So, boys and girls, you've probably heard the whispers about this. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, read that good and fast. I actually can read. I'm just, I get flustered sometimes, and so like I'll fuck up a word and I'll just look like an. Oh god! Oh wait. Uh. Ow. Oh. Oh Jesus. Wow. That was a <clears throat> quite the hit you took there. Um. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. I can read. I just... I don't want to look like an idiot. God damn. damn. Yeah, that's help. for sure. This will help. What? Ah, I don't need to... I don't want to look at my stupid menu thing. Oops. Uh, Crouch. Crouch. There we go. Oh, there we go. Okay. So, yeah. Oh, rumbly, 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 rumbly. Spooky, spooky, scary, scary. Boo -boo 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 -boo. Wait, let's go this way first. I think there's something down this way. <coughs> oh, the smoke. <coughs> yeah, as you can tell, my voice is all bleh, bleh, again. Which is really actually kind of fresh. Oh, oh, hey. Which is actually really frustrating. Um, I don't know if you guys care or not, but um, uh, I actually used to sing a long time ago. Uh, been, you know, through choirs and coached for about, I don't know, six or so years, and uh, my voice was, <coughs> I wouldn't say amazing, but it, it was pretty decent, it was pretty strong, uh, you know, a lot of, one of the things I used to love to do as a kid was always, you know, mimic, I, could, I was really good at mimicking voices um, and singing and stuff like that, and so it was just kind of like a real big, you always know working Joe, oh, someone knew, well, yeah, he just said, you always know, anyways, um, so yeah, my voice was kind of a big part of who I was, and uh, unfortunately, um, due to uh, some shenanigans happening, um, <coughs> excuse me, a couple months ago, um, I actually, 
I don't know what I did, but um, I significantly damaged my vocal cords. Um, I'm talking like throat polyps, tore something, um, throat nodules or something, but it, it was pretty bad. And so I'm actually still recovering from that, but it's been, I want to say like nine months already. Hello? So it's been a really long time since my voice has healed. Um, so, sorry about that, uh, got cut out for a second there, for some reason, that was weird. Um, but anyways, it's been like, <coughs> eight or nine months or so since my voice has, Doesn't um, really come back, work. so I'm actually, uh, hopefully gonna see, I would hope so, so I'm hopefully gonna see, uh, a therapist, um, here pretty soon, or some sort of throat doctor and have him look at my throat, cause it's, uh, it's been pretty frustrating lately. Um, I don't know if you could tell the difference between uh, this episode and last, but um, my voice was doing a lot better and then it just kind of like crapped out again. And so I was a little upset about that, but we'll see what happens. What's this? Uh... Oh, oh, the code. Zero, three, four. Uh, you're looking for a stat. Oh, oh, okay. I know it's going. Oh, excuse me. How's this? Blah, blah, blah. Oh, wait. <coughs> Harris and Turner, get back here now. We have a track somewhere in engineering. Lock the terminal down, kill the power, and don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're gonna need our paperwork to be bulletproof when this shit's over. Wait's up. Okay, then. Uh, power. <coughs> hey, look at that. Uh, oh, hey, hey. Who are you? So yeah, <laughs> I, ow, that actually kind of hurt. So yeah, um, for a while, uh, my voice is gonna be kind of quiet, and I'm gonna try and talk really low, and try not to aggravate my vocal cords at all, because um, it's not fun. It fucking hurts at times. And ooh, a thing. I should probably sprint more. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Got it. Oh. So press. Oh, to activate my flare. Ah oh, crap, what was it? Uh, zero, three, four, zero? Hey, look at that. Crap. What do we got? Stuff? Things? Ooh. Some stuff? Uh, oh. Oh. Oh, there it is. Flare. Med kit. Oh, sweet. Okay, so yeah, like I mentioned before in the first video, there is some crafting mechanics, which is awesome. Uh, I filled around with it just a little bit just to kind of get used to it. And, oh, sweet, I have enough. And I guess you just, you know, kind of randomly collect crap that you find around and find blueprints for whatever it does. And you can craft something. So, ooh. Let's see, what do you got? This stuff. <coughs> uh, I apologize for the coughing and whatnot, but it's trying to clear shit out of my throat. Let's see. So what am I doing? I think I'm looking for help or something. Oh. No. Oh. Um. Oh, okay. But turn it out on the lights on me. I need to see. Assholes. Whoa, that got loud. Whoa, what is happening? What is that? Oh, duck. <laughs> ah, god damn it. Every time. I can never seem to miss that thing. I always get zapped. I think there's something here on the seats or something. No, nothing. Uh, yeah. <coughs> ah, see, I knew there was something. Yeah, if you haven't already figured out uh, from the way that I play things, I'm a scavenger. Ooh, what the that's hell pretty. happened here? That is really neat. Your guess is as good as mine, lady. Actually, I already know what happened here. An alien happened here. fuck is that sound? I feel like something's supposed to happen. Door locked. But I am a torch. I don't have that. Ooh. Orchestra kicked in. Strangers will be shot. That's good to know. Where is it? There it is. Hey. Guys. Help. I'm over here. Can't you see me? Wish I could jump. 
I'm not, I'm not, I don't want to waste my flare. We're late. Stop it. Yeah, damn it, I'm right here. Help. Uh, I don't think they saw me, guys. Yeah. Yeah, that would suck. Uh, so let's see. Where am I? Where am I? <laughs> <clears throat> Julia Jones, today's update. After numerous demands, Marsha Waits finally called a public meeting to address the rumors that have been circulating on Sevastopol. But instead of the answers we wanted, he continued to be evasive, and after only a few minutes, he and his team were pelted by projectiles from an angry crowd. A gun was fired, there was panic, and now Waits and what's left of his team are forcibly ejecting us from the terminal. Feels like we're on our own now. This whole damn place is falling apart. <laughs> 